thank you so much, uh, Dr. Prakash. And with that, I would like to thank all the speakers for such an invigorating session. And I hope every one of us has some key takeaways from the session and got some more clarity on the climate change in the Indo-Pacific. And with that, I would like to invite Dr. Sridhar to share the highlights of today's sessions. Dr. Sridhar. Thank you. Thank you, Utsav. Uh, it was a wonderful session. And in fact, with the culmination of this interesting session on climate change, uh, we are just halfway now. Of course, uh, the next half is uh, we have a very uh, distinguished panelist tomorrow also. So I would request all the um, participants to log in tomorrow again at uh, 10, 15 uh, a.m., not p.m. So please uh, do join us. I mean, those who are in India, it is, of course, uh, it should be a.m. Uh, but just to briefly uh, touch about uh, the day's proceedings, we had a very good kickstart in the, uh, in the morning, uh, with the, in the evening, of course. Uh, with an inaugural, uh, we had a very distinguished uh, inaugural panelist. Uh, Dean Madan uh, opened it, and then we had GL Reefman, uh, Jennifer Larson, and uh, G. V. Prasad, an industry leader, who set the tone for the entire day. Uh, this was followed by an interesting discussion on uh, uh, geopolitics uh, between Happy Mon Jacob and uh, uh, Ambassador Shiv Shankar Menon. And they discussed about the key drivers that uh, actually will shape the Indo-Pacific uh, gains uh, towards uh, covering military, economic, and political aspects, and their implications for uh, India's strategy autonomy. Uh, and then we had a very interesting and involving panel discussion where uh, um, Suhasini Heather moderated it, and that was on security partnership. Uh, I mean, they evaluated India's uh, foreign policy, especially in the context of the current Russia-Ukraine uh, war, and uh, also its uh, implications for security partnership in the Indo-Pacific. Uh, of course, we had a distinguished panelist there, uh, General Prakash Menon, uh, Arjun Subramanyam, and uh, Dr. Jagannath Panda. And uh, that was an extremely interesting session. Uh, we then had a discussion on uh, uh, maritime uh, policy, in fact, rule-based maritime order where uh, basically many of the Indo-Pacific countries would like to see a rule-based order in the Indo-Pacific, but there are a lot of uh, critical issues as far as the seas are concerned, like the South China Sea, and uh, which is actually creating a couple of uh, differences. And in fact, the entire notion of uh, ASEAN centrality is also being questioned uh, by many of the uh, countries. So uh, this is actually making the rule-based order a bit difficult in the Indo-Pacific, but it was important discussion. And uh, I must say that uh, we are halfway through uh, in creating a roadmap for the Indo-Pacific regional cooperation. Um, and we are yet to come. And we had a very interesting and uh, final session on climate change. Uh, thanks, Anjan, for all the this thing. And where we, of course, discussed on uh, climate justice, climate security, um, and climate change as a stress multiplier and many other aspects. Of course, you all know that. So uh, with that, uh, I must actually briefly uh, touch upon about tomorrow's session, uh, we will start with uh, having a regional uh, dialogue, talking about the importance of uh, alliances and partnership. And, and we have uh, none other than Dr. Sanjay Baru, Honorable Lisa Singh is the Australia India uh, Institute uh, CEO. And uh, we have Ambassador Sham Sharan, who they will be discussing. And then we will also have an economic dialogue and, and discuss how uh, we can collectively enhance the prosperity in the Indo-Pacific region. And that will be followed by a high profile diplomatic round, diploma, diplomats roundtable, uh, where we have the perspectives from US, Japan, and uh, EU, EU leaderships. So we will actually conclude the day with a validatory address by Dr. Vinay Sastrabuddhe. Uh, who will talk about the importance of uh, soft power to strengthen the Indo-Pacific construct. So, uh, friends, and uh, please block your time for the day tomorrow morning. 
and uh, please join us without fail. And with that, uh, thank you all. Thank you, all the panelists. Uh, and it was a wonderful show as a well. whole. Thank you. Thank you.